Hello, my name is John Flanagan and I'm 23 years of age. Or rather I was. Way back in the early 1970s, all those years ago, when I actually earned my living as a presenter. I was working for Granada Television in Manchester as a journalist, reporter, interviewer and presenter on their live local news programme. Before that, I'd trained and worked as an actor. And when I left news and current affairs, I went back to drama. Since when, I've had a long and varied career as a professional actor, combined with being a scriptwriter for many well-known TV drama series. However, when the opportunity came up to re-explore presenting, I jumped at it, especially as I got it at a knockdown prize on Groupon. So here I am. At my age, I'm hardly a wannabe. I'm more a can-I-still-be. Can I still cut it as a presenter, as I did all those years ago on the news programme? Well, I'm looking forward to the challenge, but first, here's Bill with the weather. Old habits die hard. Hello, and welcome to the Travel Guide. Now, how do you fancy some winter sunshine? Sound good? Well, you could be the lucky winner of today's holiday competition. All you need to do is answer this simple question. Which fortified wine takes its name from the Portuguese town of Oporto? Or as the Portuguese say, Oporto. Is it A, Sherry, a B, a Madeira, or C, Port? If you think you know the answer, hit the phone lines. Call us on 0800 222 3. Those calls will cost no more than 25 pence a minute. And we will announce the winners at the end of the programme. Now, talking of winter sunshine, here's Brian with the weather. Hello and welcome to Fit and Fabulous at 50 Plus. The feisty, fun way to grow old and grow. My name's Danielle Collins and I'm a health and fitness expert. And I'm John Flanagan and I'm not. <laughs> Tonight, Danielle, we'll be, amongst other things, we'll be looking at foods to increase your libido. Mm. Now I'm thinking oysters. Full of zinc and antioxidant strong. Very good. My age, I need all the help I can get. <laughs> we'll also be looking at exercise machines, the pros and the cons, what works and what doesn't. Well, to me, they're all cons. <laughs> I don't think you can beat a healthy wrist walk in the country, especially if you're pulling a golf buggy behind you. <laughs> I think that's just a good excuse to hang out with his mates. Well, at least they understand. Someone's got to. <laughs> and finally, uh, Danielle, you're going to give us some very special tips, is that right? I am, John. I'm going to be showing you five fabulous ways to take ten years off your face. Ooh. And apparently divorce isn't one of them. <laughs> anyway, all that's to come up. But first of all, here's Judy the foodie with things to avoid in the kitchen. 